Okay, let's move on to the, the big one, the mathematics links. Uh, this page has evolved over many years and I just keep my ears flapping and people say, have you tried this, have you seen this, and that's uh, how it's evolved. Uh, so to make it manageable, I've split it into sections. First of all, mathematical education, uh, classroom resources, mathematical entertainment, sort of end-term stuff, and probabilities and statistics. So let's see how that actually breaks down in practice. So the math education, first of all, for England, Wales, and Northern Ireland, we've got all the sites, including, of course, uh, the new MTI site, uh, and uh, Math Association and other organisations, and the government organisations, MEI, and so on. Then the similar things in different countries, if you're interested in that. After all, it is a global subject. Everybody learns mathematics at school um, in every country uh, around the world. So uh, here are the different links to different countries and their organisations. Uh, then we've got classroom resources from the UK. Top of the list, of course, is Enrich. Uh, but there's some other gems not far down. The Plus Maths Magazine, I think, is fantastic for any curious 16-year-old. Uh, MathNet and MathNet.com, terrific sites from Brian Dye, uh, now a subscription site. Waldo, amazing Java apps written by a teacher. He just taught himself Java and is covering no end of different topics. And uh, as I say, I could mention each one of these. They're all there for a purpose because someone had said they're really good. And uh, here we have UK school base. Now these are written by school teachers in their spare time. So I think this is a really good uh, place to put uh, things that are worth a second look. Uh, and I'll just uh, zoom past those now and go on to the worldwide sites. So these are sites from different countries and uh, ones that have caught my eye either when I've been there or I've read about them. Um, lovely ones from Canada and China, Estonia and France. Um, and the Japanese Java apps are really superb, although they stopped writing them now. In the Netherlands, the um, applets from the Freudenstolz Institute are superb and really well professionally written applets. Then we've got uh, resources from the States. Plenty of those, of course. Then we have the entertainment side, uh, the games, uh, links to different sites, Andrew Jeffries sites, for example. Then you've got sites to do with number. Ron Knott's amazing site to do with Fibonacci and the Golden Ratio. Likewise, Gary Meisner. Simon Singh's sites. Different lots of pie sites. Uh, lots of nice sites about number and powers of ten and space. Fantastic. Then we've got some art and fractals. Lots of movies, YouTube food movies to do with mathematics. And uh, lots of references to mathematics in movies down here and clips from 3D movies that might be of interest if you're teaching some 3D stuff. Then the competitions in history. These, uh, the, these are obviously very important but the history, there's so many opportunities to bring history into your teaching now. Then bits and pieces down here which I couldn't really categorize and then you've got a section of primary stuff that's useful for the younger children. And finally, probably statistics, uh, lots of interesting sites here from around the world. Uh, who drives on the left, who drives on the right, Google Gapminder, Global Carbon Emissions, lots of data from here, there and the other, and also some sites to do with probabilities and statistics. Otherwise, there's lots of other people's lists. I mean, my list is only one list of a possible list. Of course, the best list of all is Google, but um, other people are trying to do the same thing, and some of these are, are good fun. Okay, so that's my um, mathematics website, and I hope you found it useful.